Five robot dogs had been hacked and transformed into transgenic and chimerical animals. To allow the dogs to be reprogrammed, some hardware modifications are necessary. A MAX232 chip has been soldered to allow the communication with a PC. An internal flash memory that will contain the new program has been added. A bootloader has been installed to allow the robot to read the flash memory. Now the program written in a C can be downloaded through the serial port. This hybrid animal is the perfect mix between two domestic animal species, one canine and one feline. This new species combines the independence and cleanliness of a cat, as well as the affectionate and playful nature of a dog. The universal pet is born. After CC, the first cloned kitten in December 2001 at Texas A&M University, it's now possible to clone your favourite dying or dead pet and to produce a pet à la carte. Since Dolly, the first mammal cloned in 1996, both sheep and bovine specimens have encountered difficulties. BSE, mad cow disease, progeria, premature aging, abnormal size and other various pathologies. This species aims to cure all the side effects of cloning and any deterioration of DNA.
This animal has all the normal characteristics of a dog, but he also has a phosphorescent coat. This peculiarity has been obtained by transferring into the genome of the animal the coding gene of the green fluorescent protein present at the natural state in jellyfish and commonly used to mark the cells. After the fluorescent mouse and Alba, the famous rabbit of Eduardo Cal, GFP Puppy marks the beginning of a new age of animal cloning, that of more evolved and complex species. While the pig is an animal of sufficient intelligence and sociability to make the perfect pet, it is also the best species to supply organs for xenotransplantations. This animal has also the same genetic defect as the nude mouse. The genome of this animal has been enhanced with the gene of the hydrozoan jellyfish family, as well as the gene of the chameleon, well known for its ability to blend in with its environment.
Ah! <laughs> 